Y'all, don't think the people that was plotting to go against you, motherfuckers that knew your anointedness, knew that you were meant from the divine, knew such capabilities that you were meant to impact mankind with. Don't think they ain't suffering behind closed doors because of such. They were planning on doing some malevolent thing. They were actually conspiracizing about doing some low vibrational things. Funny thing, right? God will speak. God will talk every time. God letting you know motherfuckers malicious intent ways. You feel me? God will let you know through some occurrence that it know it can get through to you. That is the thing. Everybody is different, but it's different because they got us categorized in multiple, you know, variances. So, you know, like, uh, divergent. They got doubtless. They got, uh, amidite. They got, uh, uh, candor. They got, um, what's it called? Like they got multiple categories. They got multiple. So it classifies people into different you know, subject, I mean, you know, it just puts you into like a different box. So then that way you can't compare or you can't relate to other people, just like religion. I ain't going to bring that up in my subject. I'm just going to make it analogy and that's it. I'm going to keep it pushing. So I'm telling you, though, it's just so you don't, you're less likely to learn from outer influences. I know. Makes no sense. You can learn a lot from a lot of people. So don't think that they not like in a place of like suffering where they know they're slowly declining. See, when God wants to punish you, he ain't going to just do it quick, fast. Nah, that's 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 sweet. That's that's nice. That's like generous. You feel me? Where you don't even know it. Nah, God moves in a way as he's going to make them experience way more 10 times the amount of what they made you experience. While giving you fortune, abundance, prosperity in the process. That's God. You you hear me? The first is last and the last shall be first. So you all be mindful of that. So that's what I'm saying. Like, don't think you got to get revenge. You don't ever have to get revenge. That's the problem in our community. If, if black people, if carbon people will start to understand that. If so, you don't have to worry about when people do you wrong. Don't sweat it. Don't sweat the small stuff. Look, if someone does you wrong and the more love you treat them after fact or the more love that you start to exude from your body, you, you actually hurt them 10, a thousand times worse than if you were to get emotional, malevolent in the process and mirror back the same thing that they put off to you. Yeah, that God, be like, oh, no, nah, I ain't going to punish them that they equally um, agree to it. But when you do not get mad and you just show love, you're like, OK, and you show gratitude and you show that God vibration God's like okay I'm gonna handle this shit times a thousand that's how God works I'm telling you God works in mysterious ways for a reason so now you see so the more love you show if you really want to get back at a person you just show more love I'm telling you it's, it's, it's what we call down in Westbrook a win 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 you win from every angle every single angle you ain't even gotta sweat it but these people lose from every single angle yeah they were first but now they last and yeah, you were last, but now you're first. You don't got to be last no more. Problem solve and claim the new found wealth that you're about to receive. Claim back your power and your authority. Also, claim back everything, yo. Just take back your life force in general, yo. I know it sounds crazy, but you got to use your imagination with this. Like, no one's going to talk to you and tell you about the things that's going to really benefit you when you think about it. Think about your life now. Are you really happy? Are you really rejoicing? No, you're not really. No, let's just be real and honest with ourselves. People like to fake and put on a fake facade. Like, come on. But deep down, but we can change that. Why have to keep pushing it deep down where unsolved, un, unkept, undealt with energy when we know it affects? Because you're not claiming, you're not retaking back your power, your imagination. It's still ego. Ego still operating within that space. And you know what that happens when ego operates within a space, man, it's never God. It's never source. So therefore it's never sustainable. That's just, you know, explains enough. You feel me? So get back to that God, meaning claim back your Godness, get back that energy, get back to who you were, who you are really. When you first came into this place, will continue to suffer. It is divine. It's karmatic return. 
as so you put out, as so you shall receive. It's just simple like that. That's why when you have a business, you shall receive fortune and greatness. This is what it is. It's not even a, a, a rather of if. It's a matter of when. When is it going to like, you know, all pour in? When are you just going to receive all the greatness that you are meant to receive? It's just destined to be. There are certain things that are destined to be. That's why you came through so much. That is why it needed you to be strong. It needed you to learn. It needed you to adapt. It needed you to rise up and absorb and be on that God frequency to absorb God. God's energy is inside of you. You do have God inside you. But it's up to you to either vibrate on that frequency. That's why I said many are called, but very few are chosen. Don't think because a person ain't in your face telling you about all the traumatic experiences that they're going through. They ain't going through them. Chances are they're experiencing them behind closed doors and they don't want you to know. Do you know why they do not want you to know? Because they understand that they put out so much bad shit towards you and now they have to reap what they sow. So they may be playing as things are like completely nonchalant. They may just be in like trying to be ambiguous and just trying to act like things as normal as possible. But real talk, they were putting out so much black magic voodoo. Now they reap what they sow. And what you think? God is like collecting. What you mean? It's karmatic season. And now in the next month or two, you're going to shift. You're coming into first place. You're about to receive everything. Because now you are becoming more first. You are first and they are last. And you're noticing it because you're noticing other people, other individuals who have beat you down, talked about you, uh, uh, scrutinized you. You feel me? Now they're declining. And that's how you know they were doing some weird shit behind closed doors. You know they didn't have your best interest. You know... They know that they could have helped you out and they could have helped you jump into your position that you're already jumping into, but they didn't want to see you. They were utilizing their whatever means they can tactics to control your outcome. So that way you wouldn't shine that they know you are destined for. They didn't want to see you at the top. They wanted to see you beneath them. Now they're understanding what they put out is actually have been transferring you into the, who you are meant to be. You are literally becoming the greatest self of yourself because other, other individuals has uh, shunned you, isolated you, kept you or did whatever tactics they could to keep you down by withholding funds, by pushing out low energy, by gossiping with others. And each collectively equate, uh, build an alliance to try to like lower you down, to try to uh, beat you to uh, s surrender. People, honestly, they just want to see you surrender. They want to see you a beta. Literally, people will express how they really feel. They want to actually just bend you over. I know. People will tell you how they really feel. That's what they really want to do. You notice it because people express themselves. People talk about what they do. I know real talk, as crazy as it sounds, yes, that's how they view you as. Because people can't hide themselves. People can't hide who they truly are. People will tell you in their jokes and humor, in their actions, in the way they speak. People cannot hide or run from their true selves. People will let you know who they are. That is why God always delivers what's inside a person's heart. So don't think that they can run from their karma. Their karma is already there. I'm telling you, their karma is actually either there or it's like just coming in just like a, a meteor. It's just coming. You just see it coming. It's just doo -doo 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 -doo. Countdown. Seven days, 22 minutes and six seconds. Well, I mean, at least, I don't know, man, that, that could be how long it is until this veil lifts, but this veil is lifting fast, like very fast. You notice in certain things cannot operate in the way they used to operate before. They can't keep continuing doing what, what they were doing. And that's what's freaking out a lot of people. They can't continue to operate at such a low vibration. And within other means, I ain't going to go into detail, but y'all know what I mean. Yeah, that's what it is. That's how you know. The first is now last and the last is now first. So I'm telling y'all, they, they, they getting theirs. They're all, 
everyone, everyone, people that you didn't meet, people who who that used to be once friends with, people who that used to put out low ill intent when they didn't even know you over the, the, the computer, all that. I'm telling you, all that has to return. So I'm not going to make this video too long. If you guys enjoyed this video and want to hear more about this stuff, y'all comment down below. I'm going to be putting up some other videos today. Yo, seven signs that you are now rising into your greatest self, yo. And you're about to come into an extremely amount of wealth. You're about to receive so much money. And these are the seven signs. If y'all want to hear that, just like this video and follow and share for more. I'm out.